One of the things that, that has helped me and kept me going, regardless of the pressure attacks that I get on a daily basis, is, is because I am grateful to the Lord for allowing me to suffer for his name's sake. It is a privilege that we share in the suffering of the Lord. In fact, Paul made one prayer. He says that I might, that I might conform to his death and share in the fellowship of his suffering that I might know him and the power that raised him from the dead. That's where most Christians want to stop. They want to know him. They want to know the power that raised him from the dead, but they don't want to die to experience it. Because if you want to experience the resurrection power, then you got to die. And to die is not to die physically. To die is to die daily. And to, to, to die daily is to find the footprints of the Lord and follow his ways. Always we are faced with two ways. The ways of our flesh or the ways of the spirit. The ways of the devil or the ways of God's word. The ways of our spirit, our conscience, or the ways of our lust. You got to choose. Listen to this. All of you looking at me right now, I don't care who you are. Your life is in your actions. Your future is attached to the choices you make on a daily basis. You can, through the right choices, remodify your future.